back to our third level. Let's see what this one's called. Oh, because it didn't tell me I produced the Magus quarters. Magus? Magus? Maggots? I don't know. Well, we're gonna play it for you either way. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, still on our first day of Dungeon Thunder. Just schooling, schooling some news. You put your traps? Oh, that works. You wanna put traps first round, Evan? Yeah. And then I will. Oh, second point. Ah. Oh, there you go. I'll, I'll put my towers out second round. Yeah, so we're just putting these traps out to uh, slow down the guys, and then we'll put some towers out later. Oh, this one's fun. I think this is. Oh, nice. And the lava contains its first. Is your pet floating there? I love when you jump into the lava, and then your pet will be just like floating there all alone. You're doing that on purpose. The lava. Okay, um, oh my god, look, it looks like this is 1200, or like 1200, holy shit, that's a lot. Okay, start it up. Do it. Okay, um, I'll take this side, I guess. Bye. That's a nice three sides, three players. <laughs> the explosion is gorgeous. Oh, oh it's nice the explosive is bigger, or hits them first in the gas trap. Oh yeah, so you notice like this. If you if you kill the enemies quick enough, you don't have that much issue with them. Then you'll have like this buffer, just just so they don't all spawn at the same time. Just get like yeah, an overload. Like, it's it's waves, but there's kind of little mini waves inside the waves. So, like, I just need 30 defense units, so you can use anything with 30 if you want. Yeah, like, all Thank you. Yeah, so he spent some harpoon turrets out there because there's these little dragon guys who fly around with little wyverns and they'll come from the sky and fight your face off. So, you know, we prepare for them early. There we go. Favorite oh, of course. Like, you just. I remember waking up before elementary school, getting up. Want to go bite some faces before work, Dad? Yeah, son. I don't know. That, that was a little weird. Yeah, yeah I'm no, readying out. No one stopped me. Hmm. These harpoons that shoot faster. You play online, people like just like rapid fire, so fast you don't even notice them moving. It's quicker than McJays. <laughs> McJays. So fast that you meet yourself coming to order the food when you get your food. That's picnic face, everybody. Oh yeah, picnic face is just hilarious. A very, very talented uh, Canadian sketch group. They should all... They're Canadian too, so... so. All. No, but... <laughs> this also a good if you're wondering why I'm not, like, physically attacking them with my weapon and just letting my towers roll the damage, is because, like, see in the bottom right there right now, you get modifiers based on what you do. So if you only use your weapon, or if you only use tower damage, then you get an extra 30% damage. You also get that from the damage troops and experiments. Yeah. So we're good. Yeah, because uh, bottom of the screen, a little bit in the left, um, the little bar there, that's your experience. You watch it slowly goes up. And so you need experience to level up, of course. And so you get experience with killing guys, you get a big bonus at the end of the level. And the bonus is um, modified by modifiers, I guess, depending on how you do in the game. The things that you have to crystal the thing in the bag, or if there's even towers out, whatever, you know, well, so it's just good. Leveling up is good. Shows how gangster you are. I also want to put this out, because if you use all of your tower units, you get an extra bonus. Even though, like, we're high enough levels that it's very insignificant, it's just, it's nice to be like, oh, look, extra points. Wow, look at all those harpoons. Check the map, guys. It's hilarious. Overkill is the name of the game. 
Are you sure? Are yeah. You sure about that? Look at them all. That was maggots. Maggots. Maggot quarters? Get them like maggot that. quarters. Maggots quarters. Insane hardcore. Okay, Ananda. Ananda. Maggots. Bob, maggots. Hey, there's the. See the wyverns. Look at them all. The wyverns all the hardcores all shoot at the same time, so they kind of crisscross. Crisscross. There are just not enough hardcores. Oh, I wish I had more units because I don't know if I can handle it all. Like this is this is significantly hard. Like OMG, bro. No, like OMG Bob. OMG Bob is like super OMG. That's OMG Bob. Where have I heard I that before? That. Didn't you used to say that, Evan? I'm the Bob. No. I'm the Bob. Say uncle. Say uncle. Oh, yeah. oh, the significance of hardcore mode is you get more experience and it's hardcore. So like if you die once, you're, you don't respond to the next wave. Yeah, it's pretty hard. Well, like nightmare hardcore maps were like, I'm sure when we get to the harder maps, we'll have a bit more difficulty. Well, maybe. Well, whatever, friends. We just need to try our hardest. That's all anyone can ever ask. It's for the dead. Yeah, we're straight legged. <laughs> Bob legged. Oh, are they almost fall into the lava? Look at the Nanda. That's you, Nanda. But the Bob side. Oh, so now we're still waiting for that. There's the final onslaught of enemies. Yes, yeah, so there's different types of enemies. There's little goblins, little big orky type guys, little like archer guys, little ninjas, little kamikaze you got big bombs, and there's the big with ogres. Uh, there's even some little necromancer summoner guys, with some of the little skeletons. Yeah, yeah. just a wide variety. Yeah. Oh, I like the wide ones. It's also based on what difficulty you're on. You'll have like different difficulty, like because they go by color. Um, just like, just like the different. There's different levels for different um, traps and such. There's different levels for enemies. So level one through five. I'm not sure. Because I think they start around. What is it? Green or blue? Evan, for the first one. It's green and then blue. And then they go yellow. Yeah, and then yellow, red, red. and then Generally, purple. Generally, the way that like it would go is like green is easy, blue is medium, yellow is hard, red is medium, or sorry, red is insane. And then um, those are also difficulty levels that you play on. And then there's a uh, nightmare mode that has uh, purple guns. You want to watch? Yeah, purple. Uh, I know. I remember back in the back in the old days, purple ripples are always bad. So that's how you know that the the guys are bad. Oh, that's totally where it came from. You don't want that purple ripple. I'm gonna need a little bit more mana, and then I can upgrade this all the way. There we go. Arjun, what the fuck is that? I want a nerf. I want a purple. Actually, no, that's a good question. I am not sure what a nerf will be. It's, it's almost it's like a nerf from um, Garfield. Yeah, that's all I was thinking. I can't remember what nerf was. Oh, there's the other. It's just like like normal except you have a It rolls to the top so easily. I was just gonna say if you have normal. But then you just had to steal it. You just had to One more. There we go. <laughs> so there we go. That's the third level of the maggot quarters. I mean maggot support. I mean I don't even know what we're talking about. <laughs> yeah, we'll see you guys at uh, the next level.